Hey guys, it's Carol here. Welcome back to my channel. It's good to be back. Thank you so much for your patience. I was sick for a little bit with the cold and then allergies. The family was sick and then life got really busy really quickly, but in a good way. So things are going really well and I hope things are going well with you guys. Today I have for you some, um, actually I chose 10 nail polishes that when I looked at all of my polishes that I'm looking forward to for the winter, these just happen to be my favorite, the ones I'm looking most forward to wearing. Some of them are actually brand new to me um, that were gifts from a friend and some of them I've already used. So some of this we'll discover together, but um, I've heard good things about the ones that are new. So we'll, we'll play with those together. I did swatch them on my hands for you. So hopefully that gives you a good idea of what these look like on my skin tone as well. And the bonus is that I'm doing this in collaboration with two other really fantastic and sweet women here on YouTube. One, and I'll have them both listed below. One is Carrie Mikkel, and the other one is Sandy from Sandy Rella Midnight, I believe is her YouTube name. And I'll have them both listed below. Um, I think you'll really enjoy them. So I highly encourage you after the video to go check out their channels and see which they've chosen for you. I know Carrie has chosen five nail, pro uh, nail polishes. I think that's what she narrowed it down to. And um, yeah, I'm really excited to see like what kind of colors she's picking out for the winter. Um, and you'll, you'll kind of see a trend with my colors. So anyways, without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump into the nail polishes. The first one I have here, um, I'll start with the reds, I guess. This is new to me. One of my friends sent me a Christmas package. So thank you again to her. She is so, 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 so doggone sweet. I just, she blows me away. And so several of them here um, are actually some of the ones she sent me. One of them is this beautiful Michael, I'm a hot mess today, sorry. Beautiful uh, Marc Jacobs, because <laughs> I have a Michael Kors polish here. Marc Jacobs polish, it's so pretty. I mean, I've looked at these in Sephora before and just thought, oh my God, those are beautiful. But yeah, Mama cannot be investing right now on a Marc Jacobs polish, but this, I mean, it's so pretty. And the color is like right up my alley. This is in the color Jezebel, super pretty. I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, this is, yes, this is me. This, these are my colors in the fall and the winter. I just, they look really good on my skin tone and they just, yeah, they're just very flattering. So I love it. And then no worries if you're in my boat and you're like, I can't afford a Mark, Mark Jacobs. Yes, I can't afford a Mark Jacobs policy, the girlfriend. That's okay because this from L'Oreal, yes, L'Oreal, this is called Bold Bordeaux. It's beautiful. And I'm basically wearing both of them right here. So on my hand right here, um, I'm wearing right here is the Marc Jacobs Jezebel and then right here I'm wearing a bold Bordeaux from L'Oreal and everything is just one coat because I wanted you all to see how opaque it is with just one coat and that way you can kind of use your imagination to kind of think about what it would look like with two coats or three. Uh, so yeah, those are those two great alternative to the Marc Jacobs. I mean, I cannot, I can't see a difference. Maybe with two coats you'd be able to, but I can't see a difference and I think it's just beautiful. The third color I have right here is very similar to these two except it has some like brown and copper thrown into it and it's an OPI polish and the drugstore polish and this one is called Romeo and Joliet. Joliet, not Juliet, Joliet. And this one's super pretty too. And I love colors like these because they're just, like I said, they're really flattering on my skin tone. And yeah, because I have really light like, complexed. So Mama likes my dog colors, okay? So I love these. OPR like around $8 at the drugstore. So yeah, that's a really beautiful one. So thank you again to her for those. Um, also, I have Formula X polish that she sent me. And this is called X Rouge. And this to me, this one and the other one I'm about to show you are just what I think about. I think of like Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus. They're just like your Santa red, you know? Um, and this is by the Formula X polish that you pick up at Sephora, which is another high-end polish, but I've heard really great things about these polishes. Everyone that like, has these just loves them. So if you do own a Formula X polish and you can definitely you know, let us know what you like about these polishes. Leave your comments and your little mini reviews down below in the comments so we all can know what are the fantastic things. Like, are they long wearing? Are they just, I don't know. Let us know. So this is a beautiful color 
And then she also sent me this other one. I've never heard of it, and I just thought I'd mention it just in case I have any other Canadians watching. Um, it's by the brand C and E, which stands for Crab Tree and Evelyn, and it's called Apple. So um, again, I cannot even tell the difference between these two. So if you look up closely, um, this is the Formula X polish, your Santa Claus Red. And then this one is your CNE polish, and they're just very much the same. So I just, I love, like these reds are also really pretty against my skin tone in the holiday Christmas time. So really like those. Let's go to my other hand now. I have over here a few Michael Kors. That's why I was going to mix up with Marc Jacobs and Michael Kors polishes. Beautiful. I mean, they're so pretty. They're just like you just want to decorate a vanity with them, you know? So this one is called Java. And I like Java because it's like a taupey purple, like a frosty taupey purple. And, um, this is just, I don't know, when it gets like rainy and stuff like that, I tend to want to wear a purple of some sort. So for winter time, I think like a frosty taupey purple is really pretty. So I like that one a lot. And um, I also have this one called Frida's Nude and it's a L'Oreal polish. It's in their like special celebrity collaboration collection that like JLo's in there and some other people, I don't know who they are, like other actors and or actresses, sorry. So this one's called Frida's Nude and this is really pretty. I got this one at Target and, I re and the reason I really loved it is because I saw this and I thought this would be great for fall and winter because I got in the fall and I still, like, I still haven't worn it yet. But I thought like this would be a great color when I don't have time to think and I just need something to go with anything, like just a great neutral. So this is kind of like a frosty, uh, taupey pink. Um, you, you, you see pink, you see silver, you see gold, you know? So it's just like this you know, kind of rose gold, but not really. I just, I would describe it more of like a taupe pink or something, like a frosty taupey pink. So I do really like that one. Um, yeah, and you can get that at drugstores. Okay, I have another Michael Kors here, and this one is called Bosa or Bossa Nova. Let me know if you know how to pronounce that. Um, this one's very pretty. Another great one, another one that I love for if I don't have time to think but I want to polish my nails and make them look pretty. This is like clear but it has this um, pink and gold iridescence to it. It has like flecks of pink and gold in there so you get to see both on there depending on how the light hits it. Um, it looks really interesting in the package and the package it looks a lot more gold but when you put it on your fingertip you definitely start to see more of the pink, you know, reflex on it. So really interesting, really pretty. So that's so nice. And thank you again to my friend for these polishes. They're so beautiful. Um, here's another Michael Kors. This one's called Ocean. So this is like a really frosty, uh, snowy blue, you know, it's called Ocean, but I just totally, you know, it's like that Christmas ornament blue, you know, so I just think that's really pretty. Again, when it starts to rain and things like that, I tend to want to wear blues or purples, so this would be a nice option when it's cold and rainy. <laughs> All right, so the last one I have here is, when you look at it, it looks purple, but then when I put it on, it looks more midnight blue when I put it on. So this is by the brand Mineral Fusion. My friend's from Canada. So I'm not sure if this is like only a Canada brand, but if not, if you've seen it where you all are living, then let us know down below um, or if you know where to get these. So this is called Midnight Ridge and that's what that looks like right there. Um, it's, it's, again, a really nice option for me. If it's rainy or something like that, I'll probably want to wear like this type of color. Yeah, I just think they're great. So, all right guys, so that's pretty much it for me. 10 polishes. I hope you've found something helpful in some way. I got some great alternatives there that just happened by accident. Let me know if you have any specific questions and I'll be happy to answer those for you. Remember to go check out Carrie's and Sandy's no polish picks. Carrie has five. I'm not sure how many Sandy has. Probably somewhere between five and 10, I'd assume. And they're really sweet girls. I just, I think they're just, really nice women and I think you'd enjoy them. They're both 
mothers, and I think they're both stay-at-home moms as well. So yeah, for all my fellow moms out there, if you have an interest in that, they're just really sweet. So anyways, thanks for hanging out with me today, guys. I will have more videos coming for you this weekend, so make sure to subscribe if you're new, and thank you so much if you came from Carrie's or Sandy's channel. I really appreciate that, and I hope you found something helpful for you something helpful for you today. I hope you all enjoy the rest of your weekend and I'll see you all in the next video. If you have any requests, leave those down below and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.